My name is Thomas and this is my first physical exam video for APN, uh, APN 624. Um, this is my patient. So I guess we'll do a mock interview. Um, first off, how do you do today? My okay. name's, you doing okay today? <laughs> My name is Thomas and I am a uh, student nurse practitioner. So I am going to establish your mental state, uh, get a quick history on you, and do a little bit of a physical exam, okay? So I'm going to use the Glasgow Coma Scale. So can you tell me your name? Molly. Molly. And can you tell me what year it is? 2021. And do you know where you're at? I'm at home. So her GCS score would be 15, and uh, the next steps are, I'm going to ask you some questions, okay? Um, why are you here today? Just for a checkup. Just a, just a wellness check, okay. Are you currently taking any medications? Nope. Do you have any allergies? No, just seasonal. Just seasonal allergies. Do you take anything for them? Every once in a while, I just take like choruses or something to try okay. to sweeten. Okay. Do you have any chronic illnesses or health uh, health issues? No. Have you ever been hospitalized or had any surgeries? No. No. Okay. Can you tell me a little bit about your family, like your uh, mother, uh, father, and uh, if any siblings? My name is. Um, uh, any health related issues that you know of? No. Diabetes, hypertension. My mom has a high blood pressure. Mother has high, high blood pressure. Anything with your father? Nope, healthy. Uh, and you said you had a brother? Yes, he's younger. He's five. He's five. Okay, um, now I'm going to ask you some questions about your social history. Um, do you do uh, any kind of alcohol or anything? I mean, not weekly. Just the occasional drink? Okay. What about smoking? No. No? Okay. All right. Do you mind if I do my examination? Go ahead. Okay. So the first thing we'll look at is the patient's uh, general appearance and, and their skin. So I can see that she's got a full head of hair and her skin looks healthy we can um, assess temperature and uh, texture and everything by looking at the skin so I'm looking for appropriate for ethnicity I'm looking for any kind of uh, rashes abrasions lesions cuts bleeding anywhere across her body you have anything that you know about no. that you need to take a look at no. Okay, I'm also go, I also check skin turger, uh, turger by tinting and looking for the elast elastic, uh, elasticity of it. Okay, so it looks generally pretty good. I'm also going to look at her nails. I'm looking for capillary refill within normal limits. I'm also looking for any kind of clubbing or pitting. So it looks good. Um, the next thing I'll move on to is the, the head. So I'll see if there's anything else going on. So first I start by palpating the scalp. Just kind of feeling for any kind of, well, I'm so British. I'm just going to bring this person. <laughs> <laughs> you good? <laughs> I'll also palpate the sinuses. Did it listen anything? No. I also palpate uh, the TMJ, so go ahead and open and close your mouth. Any pain? I'm looking for pain or like a clicking upon opening. Um, a click. A little bit of clicking. Mm -hmm. The next thing I'll check is her uh, lymph nodes, starting with the pre-auricular, the posterior auricular, the occipital, the tonsillar, the submandibular, 
the submental, the superficial cervical, the posterior cervical, the deep cervical, and the supraclavicular. I'm looking for pain, tenderness, or a palpable lymph node. I'm also looking for any kind of jugular vein distension or anything like that within her neck, and I don't see any. I'm also checking to make sure her trachea is midline, palpating her uh, thyroid for any kind of nodules or pain. Can I swallow for me? Feels like a strong swallow. Uh, the next thing I will inspect is your eyes and your eyebrows. Your eyebrows are full. I don't see any kind of uh, missing hair or anything. I'll also look for her lacrimal glands just to make sure they're not occluded. Also note the color of her sclera is white. This is my scope because I don't have one. <laughs> First I'm going to check her pupils. Let me write my notes. Dependent and then consensual. Um, let's see, eyes, and then, oh. Next, I'll move on to her nose, noting the uh, symmetry of the bridge of her nose and her external nostrils. Then I will look up the nares. So go ahead and look up for me. Noting any discharge, redness, or polyps. Like, okay. Then I can move down to the lips. I'm looking for any cracking or drying. Then go ahead and open your mouth. I'm going to note the right side. Go ahead and say ah uh, for me. Uh. Uh, I'm looking for a symmetrical rising of the uvula upon ah. Uh. Uh. Teeth are all intact. Are you missing any teeth? Do you have any false teeth or anything? No false teeth, nothing in there. Gums are pink and healthy. Um, then I will go to the ears. Uh, again, I don't have a scope, so I'm going to use my pen light and pretend. I am first going to note the external portion of the ear, looking for any kind of uh, issues. Then I will use my scope to go in and, and uh, examine the canal as I go into pulling the pen up and back. Then I would be uh, looking at the tympanic membrane on both sides. Noting a pearly gray color. Um, some abnormal findings would be some, some bubbles or fluid behind the tympanic membrane or uh, some redness or maybe some discharge. Um, head, eyes, nose, nose, throat. Uh, the next thing we'll do is we will do a Mini mental health exam. Mini mental exam. Status exam. Status exam. So let me click away here. So can you tell me what the year is? 2021. Do you know what season it is? We are in winter. Uh, do you know the date? Today is February 25th. Twenty-fifth, okay. And it is a Thursday. And you know the month? February. February. Excuse me, date. Sorry, excuse me. Um, and where are we now? We are in our house in Terre Haute, Indiana, in Vigo County. Okay, get ahead of me there. So you got the county, the city. Uh, what state are we in? Indiana. Indiana. Can you remember three words for me? Can you remember? Ball, apple, and car. Ball, apple, car. Mm -hmm. That's another one. Yeah, there you go. I would like for you to count backwards from 100 by sevens. Out loud. Okay. <laughs> 93, 86, 79, 72, 
Please God. Good. That's awesome. So if I can turn that around. Earlier I told you three words. Can you remember them? Ball, apple, and car. Awesome. Um... Can you name this object? Tim? Or light? Tim light? Yep. And you know what this is? It's a clipboard. It's a clipboard. Awesome. Can you repeat the phrase, no ifs, ands, or buts? No ifs, ands, or buts. Okay. Um, can you take this sheet of paper in your right hand? Fold it in half and put it on the floor. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> Can you read this and do what it says? Paper says to close your eyes and she closed them. See this picture on my computer screen? Can you copy that picture for me? Is that pentagons? It's two pentagons. Overlapping. Two overlapping pentagons. To note that the patient drew the two overlapping pentagons. Okay. Alrighty. I think that concludes our um, mental exam as well as our physical exam. So, do you have any questions for me? Nope. Okay. So, uh, if you don't have any questions, uh, this concludes our exam, and I hope you have a great day. Thank you.